Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And I, first let me give my many thanks to UKM for giving me this opportunity to have an interview for the TESOL course for degree for the year 2020 and 2021. Let me introduce myself. My name is Amiro Shafiq Bedo Azhari with the IC number of 01015-10443 and is currently 19 years old and living in Bandar Bagi in Selangor. A bit of background about myself. I am the first child of three siblings, parented by Noah Azari Ben Yusuf, who is a freelance photographer, and Suzila Bitti Rahman, who is a student doing her PhD, and also in UKM, in the course of civil engineering. Uh, educational, educational background-wise, I, I recently finished my foundations in UITM Denkil under the TESOL course, and going back further, Secondary, I received my I received uh, my education in SMK Jalan Pat Padabarabangi. Moving back more, primary primary education was in SK Jalan Pat Padabarabangi. Hobby wise, my hobbies are include not limited to writing, reading, drawing, and on occasions animating and even video editing. Today we're going to be talking about adjectives. Now what are adjectives? Adjectives are words that describe a noun. What is a noun? For noun, we just assume they are objects. So, for example, this is an object, a phone. The phone is a noun. How do you describe it? Now, we can say the phone is black, the phone is expensive. The word expensive and black are adjectives because they describe the noun, which is the phone. Now, commonly, how one would use adjectives commonly is to specify nouns because nouns can come in many shapes and forms and share the same name. For example, back to the example, phone. Phone can come in many shapes and forms, like a Motorola. So, let's say for example, a friend ask you to get his phone. You go to his room, there are many phones, different colors, different brands, and even different sizes. So you ask them, which phone is it? Oh, it's the black phone, for this one example. So it makes it easier without having to go pronoun or even to go specific brand names. Now, there are many forms of adjectives. But today, we are going to be focusing on three forms. Two of these, I would like to call it uh, obvious ones, and the other one is more opinion-based. So the first one, for example, simple example is color, back to the phone. The phone is black, so it is color black. We can all agree that it is color black. So that's more obvious. And then we can say the other one, size. We can say big, small, thin, or thick. For example, this book is thick, and we can see that it's thick. So we can agree that is that the book is thick. And the other, the last one, is opinions. Opinions are trick. Opinions are a tricky one because one would say one thing, but then the other might not agree. For example, coffee. You one would say coffee is delicious. Oh, this is a delicious coffee. One can say this is not delicious. This is this is a bitter coffee. See how that works? Some people might see it as bitter, but then some people might see it as delicious or even sweet. See how opinions work? One can say something, but the other might not say the same thing. And that, my friends, is adjectives. Now, the question I am tasked with was, why should I be picked? Why should I be picked into the string, the education string? So the simple answer for one is that if you look around, there aren't many male teachers right now. And I, for one, want to join to inspire, say, future boys to become English teachers and balance out the ecosystem in, uh, in due time. Now, secondly, I have a deep passion for English. I want to share some passion to everyone that I can. So. Here I am. I want to teach, uh, teach English to everyone 
where I work uh, or where I am. And lastly, I want, and I also have the passion to want to teach. I want to educate people in the English language specifically and not just work as an English teacher. So, we have finally reached to the end of the video. To the end of the video. First, let me give my thanks to Sir, Madam, anyone that's watching this. Hopefully, you can, you can accept me for the course, for the TESOL course, for degree, for the year 2020 and 2021.